Welcome to today's Standing the Gaps KISS educational series. Today we're going to cover the Essence of the Season collection. This is an amazing um, group of oils and resins. It's actually the only way to be able to get the resins of frankincense and myrrh. So first, the history behind this collection. This collection celebrates the era of sacred anointing and incense oils. Frankincense and myrrh were treasured by kings and sovereigns and were more highly esteemed than gold. Two millennia ago, these precious resins were carried by wise men from the east, traditionally called the Magi kings, who appeared in Jerusalem led by a shining star. The star went before them until it rested over the place where the young Christ child was. The Magi presented the child with the most precious gifts known to the ancient worlds, frankincense, gold, and myrrh. Capturing the essence of the holiday, this kit includes the precious gum resins and essential oils of frankincense and myrrh and the fragrant essential oil blend Christmas Spirit. The oils and resins are not only emblems of the past, but they are also future symbols of the quest for health and happiness. Frankincense originates from a legendary tree native to southern Arabia. One whose scrubby and unpretentious appearance camouflaged the res resinous treasures hidden in its bark. Called perfume of the gods by the ancient Egyptians, both the frankincense gum and essential oils were coveted by successive generations of Greeks, Romans, and Arabians. More than 3,000 tons were exported each year for the temple rituals, cosmetics, and to treat every conceivable ill from gout to a broken head. Unquote. The Roman historian, Pliny the Elder, who wrote an account of the phenomenally tight security that surrounded the processing of frankincense, said, No vigilance is sufficient to guard the factories. Before the workers are allowed to leave the premises, they have to take off all of their clothes. End of quote. Myrrh, a darker, richer, earthier aromatic was used to perform the royal mummeries of Egypt and was one of the ingredients in the sacred anointing oil of the Israelites. As both an incense and an oil, myrrh was prized by the ancients as medicine. The difference between gums and resins. Gums are water soluble while resins are not. Gum resins like frankincense and myrrh are an intricate blend of oil-based resins and water-based gums, possessing the properties of both. So how are gums and resins produced? Scrapes, incisions, or grooves are carved into the trunk of the frankincense tree and the large branches of the myrrh shrub. In response to the wound, the plants produce a thick, protectant gum resin called tears. The droplets are collected by hand and allowed to harden into small golden-hued beads. Only a few ton of frankincense are produced each year. How were gums and resins used? Historically, resins were either distilled for their essential oil content or burned as incense. Small fragments of hard resin were placed in dishes and heated or were burned over candles. Their fragrance was said to be heavenly, exquisite, and intoxicatingly beautiful, reminiscent of prayer-worn altars of forgotten, of forgotten shrines. This is just a little teaser of this collection. If you want to know more about how this promotes and supports us physically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually, grab your resources. Dive into your books and look. It is a wealth of treasures. Or go check out our YouTube page or our, our team group and look at the different um, videos and trainings that we have on each of these oils. I'm Michelle Wynn, educator and whole life practitioner. I am here to stand the gap from where you are to where you can and want to be. To get these products, get with the person that sent you here. For those of you who were led to us organically, then go to BeHealthyHisWay.com and we'll connect you with an associate that will come alongside and encourage and support you in your journey. Have a blessed day.